everyone, I am back from Sack Anime, and I'm still um, in my cosplay as Hozumi from Prince of Stride in the school uniform. Um, I decided to make a video in cosplay when I got home to do a post vlog, and also I'm probably going to do an opening of this as well because this came when I was gone, and I said that I was expecting things, so I'll probably open this after... I talk about SAC anime. Um, it was a pretty chill con this time. Um, I did have a lot of fun, but, like, it was chill and, um, like, there wasn't too much I did, but I had fun with the things I did do. Friday, I went to the Disney gathering, and that was a lot of fun. Um, I got a lot of compliments as Merida, and that was great to hear. Um... And I got a couple pictures of her in the photo room after um, the Disney gathering because um, the people who were in charge of that came into the room that the Disney gathering was in. We had it inside because it was raining outside. So it was moved to a room that was close to the photo room. And they told us that they wanted us to go into the photo room after the gathering. So I thought that was pretty cool. So we went in there after the gathering and some of us got pictures, including myself. Um, I think I got some very cute pictures with my Hamish plush. And yeah, so I can't wait to see those. And I did get more photos of her um, yesterday evening um, by a photographer that I know. So I'm glad I got some pictures of her. Um... Hopefully sometime when I get my bow finished, I can get photos of her with the bow and everything. Um, my quiver didn't quite work out the way I had hoped, so I didn't really use it in photos. But I will have that fixed up for future photo shoots and stuff. Anyway, so yesterday I was also Konata from Lucky Star, and I got a photo shoot of her from a friend I've known for a long time from Sack Anime, actually. Um... And we've been friends since 2010, I believe. And she wanted to do a photo shoot of me and Konata. And, you know, that was a lot of fun. And we, you know, caught up and stuff since we haven't really um, seen each other in a while. So it was good to catch up with an old convention friend. And that was awesome. So, yeah. Um, and then today I was hosing me from Prince of Stride. And I didn't really do much besides go to Todd Habercorn's panel with a couple friends and then I got his autograph today as well. And then that's basically it. Um, there are some people I didn't get to see this weekend that I wanted to see, but that's fine. Um, I'm sorry to those I didn't see. And I hope to see you guys at a future gathering or something. There is a gathering later this month. I am trying to go to that. Um, it all depends on transportation and whatnot. But I hope to go to that so I can see friends I didn't see that are possibly going to that gathering. So, but to those I did see, I'm glad I saw you guys. And, um, yeah. So, and I did make some new friends as well. Um, I stayed with one of the best hotel groups. And, I know I stay with, like, multiple people per convention. But, like, I think this group I stayed with is one of my favorite groups to stay with and they're planning to, uh, planning to get the Sheridan for summer so I will probably stick with them. Our hotel was a bit of a ways this time like it was for one summer convention but they said they have the Sheridan for summer or planning to so that'll be a lot more convenient so I'm still gonna stick with them though. But yeah um so enough blabbering um I did not buy much at the convention um because I didn't really see things I really needed or anything um I did go to swap meet and I don't know what is with conventions and swap meets but they're always non-air conditioned and like I don't know what's up with swap meets not being air conditioned I don't know sometimes they are it depends on where they are but like I don't know, it just felt warm, like super warm. It might be a combination of the body heat and stuff, but I don't know. Anyways, um, I didn't think I was really going to find anything at the swap meet, because um, a lot of the times when I go to swap meets, I don't really find anything I'm like looking for, or like just, you know, like, oh, I can't believe I found this, I, you know, 
kind of won't buy it. But I did find something at the last minute. Like, when I was just about done looking around, I did find something. And it is the Sergeant Frog Volumes 1 through 3 manga. And I asked them how much they were selling it for. They sold it to me for a dollar. And that's it. Like, I couldn't believe that they were selling it to me for just a dollar. I'm like, I will buy that from you. Because... I wanted something Sergeant Frog for Todd to sign, and I don't really have anything he could sign that's Sergeant Frog, but then I found this, and I thought, okay, I'm done. Like, I was, like, so happy because, like, I got that out of the way, and he signed the inside right here, and he put, Pickle Pun will be mine, and he signed it as... You know, he put Sergeant Frog right there, and then he signed his name. So I thought that was pretty cool. And he's such a sweetheart, and he's so adorable. I think he's one of my favorite voice actors. Um, I was kind of sad because he does a voice in Princess Stride. He does Riku's brother, Tomoe. But he didn't quite recognize my cosplay, but I didn't, like, blame him or anything. Because if I did the Stride version, he'd probably notice. But I wanted to do the uniform, and I thought, okay, if he notices, then that's fine. If not, it's okay. But yeah, I'm still glad I got to see him, and um, I'm glad I got to meet him again. It's my second time meeting him. I met him once before at a previous con. Um, I believe I was cosplaying stocking when I met him the first time, so. Yeah, anyways, I also got a couple other things. I got two Merida pins, because I don't have any of her yet. And so I got this one, and then I thought this one was really cute, so I had to get this one as well. I don't know if you can really see them, but yeah, I thought those were adorable. So now I have two Merida pins. Um, I might make a small Merida bag, like an Ita bag, eventually, because I kind of want to. I've been debating if I want to or should or not, because um, I have like so many planned bags to make already, and like, you know. Um, I'm probably going to like cut down on those plans, though, and just do the ones I really want to do. And I might make a small Merida one, because I love her and Brave so much. Um, and yeah, if I find enough um, Merida stuff to make a bag with, then I'll do it. So yeah, um, my voice is slowly going away, so I'm going to like wrap this up shortly. Um, but yeah, that was my sack anime, and it was fun and chill. I like when a con is like chill and not like running around every place all the time. So yeah, um, I will get to this. I think I might know what it is. I'm not sure because um, I ordered two things that are like this. And I saw one was like arriving super fast because I just ordered it a few days ago. And it was already in San Francisco when I last checked the tracking before I left for Zack Anime. Um, so this could be that item or it could be the other one I ordered a few days before that but tracking wasn't quite updating on it yet so I don't know which one this is but we will find out when I open it so I guess I shall reveal which item this is and I know it's not one of the other things I ordered because those are a lot smaller and they're not gonna be like this so I guess I will open this and reveal what it is on camera so yeah, you guys get two in one, a uh, post-con video and unboxing video in one. Okay, so it's that one. So it's the one that was coming super fast. So, yeah, it's it's the one that I ordered a few days ago, but came super, super fast. And without further ado, I give you Monokuma. Ooh, boo, 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 boo. He is going to go with um, my Danganronpa cosplays that I have planned, which is Nagito, like you guys know already. And then whenever I get Junko done, um, probably when I redo Fukawa too in the future. And when I do Juzo and whatnot. But yeah, Nagito I'm planning next, and I will have Monokuma now when I do Nagito. So, yay. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to carry him around as um, Nagito. And I'll get him out of this so you can see him better. Okay, there we go. So yeah, I guess my other um, plush item that I ordered is still on its way. I'm surprised Monokuma came so fast though. So 
yeah. There's Monokuma. It would be weird if Monokuma was in Prince of Stride. I would feel so bad for my boys. Like, I can just see Hozumi and Ayumu clinging to each other if they were in a mutual death game. My poor boys. Don't do that to my boys, Monokuma. No, I'm kidding. I, I don't think he will... That would be terrible if he just went to, like, all the animes and said, You now have to kill each other. But, yeah, no. So, yeah, that's Monokuma and whatnot. He's got, like, some loose threads that I'll have to um, fix up later. But, yeah. Pretty decent Monokuma. So, I'm excited to have him when I'm Nagito for Fanime or before then if I go anywhere to an event and want to wear Nagito. So, I have them almost done. I just have to finish the jacket and then I'm done with Nagito and I can wear him. So I will wear him to Fanime, like I said. I know I keep repeating stuff over and over. I'm still tired from the convention. So if I get repetitive or start to wander off, I'm sorry. So I'll end this now before I make it too long. Um, so yeah, Sack Anime was great and fun. Um, chill and I think it's one of my favorite Saki animes too because it was fun and another thing about this Saki anime was even after each day like when we were just chilling in the hotel room you know relaxing and whatnot it was still fun because we made all these like Disney jokes in the room, especially Gaston jokes, and it was just amazing. I think that kind of made my convention was just making all these Gaston jokes with my roomies, and that was a lot of fun. You know you have good con roomies when you guys can make jokes about something together and just laugh your ass off all night. So that was that was one of the highlights of this convention. So yeah. Um, and I hope to see you guys in my next video. It'll probably be another unboxing, because like I said, I'm expecting more things to arrive. And yes, I'm expecting another plush, and that one should probably be here soon. Maybe tomorrow? I don't know. We'll see. So, yeah, Monokuma came really fast, though, because, I, like I said, I just ordered him a few days ago. And, like, already he was in San Francisco, so. But I'm happy to have Monokuma. And yes, I did buy him with my gift card, so. You know, my eBay gift card, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm doing that thing where I'm wandering off and everything, so I'm going to go now. I will talk to you guys probably soon. Like I said, okay.